Okay, ladies and gentlemen, as I promised in the previous video about Pure Signal, the pre-distortion algorithm that has been introduced to the uh, HPSDR project, I did promise that I would demonstrate the Pure Signal on the opposite end of the chain. The previous video demonstrated the setting up and uh, uh, operation of Pure Signal on the transmitter, but uh, it's also useful to see what it looks like the other end to see what it looks like on your receiver now everybody knows what a splatter monster looks like on the bands or everyone knows what they sound like and everyone fortunate enough to have a spectrum display knows what they look like so this short video uh, I've set up my uh, Anan 100D to uh, over modulate uh, something terrible, badly set up audio chain. Uh, we're very familiar with what they look like across the bands. And uh, I've got the pure signal set up ready to go so that all I need to do is to uh, hit the auto calibrate button to bring it online. Um, I'm using a second receiver, uh, an Apache Labs Anan 10, with another um, power SDR. Uh, running and uh, that will be the target receiver and you'll be able to see my signal I'm using a pre-recorded uh, audio clip um, and as I say I've set up my audio chain badly so that we can take a look and see what my signal looks like uh, on frequency and either side of the frequency and then do the same with the pure signal enabled so without further ado let's start transmitting Hello CQ, hello CQ, Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot, Germany 7, Canada, Norway, France, Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot, testing audio into a dummy load, Heil, Pia. So as you can see, there's a fair significant amount of overspill. That's a very familiar sound to all of us. Now, I'm going to switch on your signal. Ready? No trickery involved. Shark DSP 110 into an Apache Labs HP SDR Anan 100D. Testing audio only and bye. Hello CQ, hello. As you can see, it cleans up the signal brilliantly. I'll pop it back now on frequency and uh, allow you to listen to the difference between my transmitted audio with pure signal on and off. As I say, the audio has been intentionally set up badly, so the, the improvements that are typically audible uh, on a, on a well-set-up TX audio chain are not so pronounced, but it is still very much present if you listen carefully. So I'll switch it off and to frequency. Into an Apache Labs HP SDR Anan 100D. Testing audio only and by. Hello CQ, hello CQ, Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot, Germany 7, Canada, Norway, France, Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot, testing audio into a dummy load, Heil PR40 microphone through a Behringer Shark DSP110 into an Apache Labs HP SDR Anan 100D. Testing audio only and bye. 
Hello, CQ. Hello, CQ. Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot. Germany 7, Canada, Norway, France. Golf 7, Charlie, November, Foxtrot. Testing audio into a dummy load. Heil PR 40 microphone through a Behringer Shark DSP 110 into an Apache Labs HP SDR Anan 1. And finally, just to sign off, a quick demonstration again of the improvement outside of the audio class band. So, well, that's it, friends. I uh, hope that this has been useful and uh, adequately demonstrates the benefits to be had from the HP SDR Pure Signal Pre-Distortion Algorithm 73s.